Welcome to Vegetarianism, the noble way of living. Today, we're going to cook for you tortillas, two different types of wraps, should I say. One is a tortilla and the other one is a rice wrap. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to do the tortilla. And the tortilla, they come already packed in the supermarket. Make sure you pick the vegan ones. It's just flour, water and a pinch of salt. You have to warm it up a little bit to soften it. So you put it in a frying pan, which is slightly heated, just to get it slightly warmed up. Right. As you can see, it makes it very pliable and easy to roll up. That's the reason for putting it into the hot pan in the first place, just to loosen it up a little bit. Are you ready for your first one? Yeah. Let's go. Now we have an array of ingredients here, and obviously according to taste. I'll do a little bit of cucumber. Okay. And we've sliced the cucumber very finely. Remember, keep the cucumber in the middle because we're going to have to roll this up and stretch it across like that. And then, what else are you going to have? I'll have a little bit of avocado. That's there, so put a little bit of avocado across. One, just line it up, it's okay. A little bit of sauce in it. Two, and a little bit over there. And the beauty is you can choose whatever ingredients you like. These, of course, are all vegetarian ingredients, nice and fresh. Some carrots. Yeah. Put a little bit of carrot in. And of course you can mix sweet and savoury. It works very, very well. Oi! It's <laughs> obviously hungry. Okay. And a little bit of pear maybe. Okay, put a bit of pear. And a little bit of lettuce leaf like this. Just to top it up. You want a little bit of red pepper? That's good. There we go. Okay, then sprinkle some nice roasted sesame seeds on top. Just a little bit. Some nice roasted sesame seeds all over like that. Yeah, it's really nice. Does it? And yeah. then a little bit of sauce drizzled on top of it. That's my boy. Drizzle all over. There we go. And we're almost ready to close the first one. And this is a lovely lunchtime meal. The sauce is made with a little bit of vegan mayonnaise made with a bit of mushroom sauce and a little bit of kikkerman all mixed it together. So it's got that Asian flavor. I'm going to roll the tortillas. And there we go. You just wrap it like this and roll the tortilla like that and put one toothpick inside like that and another toothpick inside like that. And there is your tortilla ready to eat. And there we go. That's how you make the tortilla with an array of vegetables and a little bit of special Asian sauce. And this is the second part of the wraps that we introduced a little earlier. And the second one is an Asian rice wrap. You buy them in supermarkets and it's just a dehydrated sheet of rice. And the way you rehydrate it is you put a little bit of warm water in a bowl and you take the wrap, you put it first on the one side just to wet it and then you turn it upside down and allow the water to soak into it. So you just allow the water to coat it because it continues to absorb the water. You just shake off any excess water and you put it onto the board. And by the time you've put all your ingredients on it, it's ready to roll. Okay, you make the first one for us. Let's put some nice ingredients on. I'll take Look. some cucumber. Okay, put some cucumber on it. Spread it nicely in the middle of the wrap. That's so it. Some red peppers. There we go. There's some red peppers. That's it. That's it. And you can put any ingredients with this that you like. As you can see, we have a whole array of ingredients. Put some nice sesame seeds. Yeah. Some um, nice Sweet. chopped spring onions into it. There we go. That's really nice. And some fenugreek sprouts which we sprouted this week freshly sprouted and a little bit of pawpaw put it inside the middle as well there we go a little bit more that i like the sweet and sour type taste so i always put a little bit of fruit in my wraps just to give it that sweetness because the sauce is quite savory we're using put a bit of celery there sprinkle it on how about some pear? I think pear would go very well with it. 
That's the beauty. You can put anything on these wraps. There we go. And finally, we're going to put a bit of sauce inside it. Sauce. Just drizzle a little bit of sauce over it. There we go. Drizzled. Now, the closing I will do. What you do is you wrap the side up like that. And then you lift this and close it neatly. Now, Pop, like yes. does it need any toothpicks? This doesn't because it becomes, as you can see, a very sticky, nice wrap. Look at it. And it just holds its own shape very nicely. And it holds its shape because of the rice paper being so sticky. And that is your rice, Asian rice wrap. Full of delectable vegetables with a nice mushroom and kikaman sauce. What do you think? You know what you should do? Sprinkle some sesame seeds right on top of it just to make it look beautiful. Look at that. Sesame seeds being an awesome source of protein. How's that? Enjoy. Welcome to vegetarianism, the noble way of living. We're going to make potatoes with turmeric and mustard seed. And if you look at the ingredients, you need to have two tablespoons of olive oil, you need to have one tablespoon of turmeric, you need to have three little blocks of uh, vegetarian... Imana. Imana, yes. Um, stock cube. You need to have chopped onion, two. You need to have some curry leaves, a good handful of them. One tablespoon of black mustard seed, one tablespoon of yellow mustard seed, and half a tablespoon of curry powder. First thing we're gonna do is we're going to put the oil into this, it's a, it's a one pot dish, so we're going to put the oil into a frying pan, an electric frying pan, just give it a swirl, let it heat up a little bit, and then put your onions inside, fry the onions a little, until they're golden brown, And while you're frying your onions, when they sort of halfway, you put in your mustard seed. There we go. Will you stir for me, my angel? Okay. There we go. Right, and as the onions are cooking, put in some brown mustard seed. Spread them around nicely, my angel. There we go. And the black mustard seed. This gives it such a nice flavour. Okay, fry it nicely and keep stirring it so that it doesn't stick. That's it. And you can hear the mustard seeds popping. And that's really what you want to do. You want to temper the mustard seeds. And once they've cooked like this, that they're starting to go nice and golden brown, you also want to bring out the flavours of the rest of the spices, which is the turmeric, one tablespoon of turmeric, put that inside and spread it all over. That's it. Mix it nicely. And then a little half a spoon of curry powder. And mix that all in. Okay, once the spices are all tempered, as they call it, we're going to add some boiling water to it. Put half a litre to start. And at this point, we're going to add the vegetable stock cubes. We're putting three in it because we don't use salt. 
Um, and the vegetable stock cube has got enough salt to give the potato lots of flavor. And you just melt it a little bit, and at this point, you're going to add the potatoes, handful for handful. And what you do now is you turn them all over to get the potatoes all coated with these spices. Bring the onion up, up to the top. There we go. Mm, looks delicious. And we eat two days with this because tomorrow they're even nicer. And finally we add the curry leaves and we put a little bit more water to bring it up because this we're going to allow to simmer in these spices for about 35 minutes at medium heat. We're going to cover it with the glass and come back to you in about 35 minutes. Hi, we're back. The potatoes have been cooking for about 35 minutes. They're nice and soft. They've absorbed all the spices and the flavors. And as I open this, mm, looks delicious. And it smells delicious. Mm, I wish you guys were here to smell it. It smells so, divine. Excellent. We're going to dish some up on a plate for you from the bottom. That's it. Full of sauce. That's it. And this can be served with rice. It can be served with um, tortillas. It can be served with rotis. It can be served with curry. It um, can be served with beans. It's good on its own and it's an accompaniment. Put a little bit of chutney with it there and a slice of lemon. That's my goal. There we go. And then a little bit of lemon. And away we go. And that's it. Thank you for joining us on Vegetarianism, the Noble Way of Living. Please stay tuned for Between Master and Disciples. Hope to see you soon. Thank you so much. All the best. Love from South Africa, Plettenberg Bay. Bye. Bye. For more details, please visit www.suprememastertv.com forward slash VEG.